Viewing parties in Hampton Roads brought tons of people out to see the partial solar eclipse in action. Angelique Arantock went to the Virginia Living Museum in Newport News where families came out in droves. Wow. It's crazy. Like, first it was big, now it's very, very teeny and small. I see the sun and a black dot. That black dot is the moon traveling in front of the sun, forming a crescent-like shape. It looks like a Pac-Man like game. Look like a Pac-Man like game. And for a moment, it dimmed slightly and cooled down a bit. It's weird to have the sun shining but not feel it. Families we spoke with at Virginia Living Museum in Newport News call it an amazing sight. It was pretty exciting. Exciting for museum staff and volunteers who brought out telescopes and other ways to witness the partial solar eclipse. That's so cool. So this telescope shows us the actual weather that's happening on the surface of the sun. Spectators also made sure to use solar viewing glasses while marveling at the moon covering the sun roughly 80% of the way. Olivia Lasher with Virginia Living Museum calls it a special event, even though our region didn't fall in the path of totality. Eclipses can happen anywhere in the world, so for it to happen this close to Virginia and to be uh, over the continental United States, it's pretty unique. Several people we spoke with remember the eclipse in 2017, but they think this year's is more memorable, especially because the next one over continental United States isn't expected until 2044. In Newport News, Inchley Garantok, 13 News Now.